contentious debate unfolding as a Manhattan school district votes in favor of a measure that could lead to a ban on transgender athletes from participating in girls' sports. There are considerable physical safety concerns. This should be investigated thoroughly to ensure we are never putting our female athletes at undue risk. In an 8-3 to three vote, Community Education Council District 2, which serves most of Lower Manhattan, Midtown, and the Upper East Side, voted to review a policy that allows transgender girls to play in female sports. Since 2019, students have been allowed to play in sports in accordance with the student's gender identity and not their biological sex. The resolution calls for a committee to be created that would review current gender guidelines and make recommendations to New York City's Department of Education. Obviously, we want to consult female athletes. We want to consult coaches, but we also want to consult doctors. We want to consult evolutionary biology experts. We want to consult with people who understand the physiology behind the issue. The Community Education Commission's 2nd District and concerned parents have voiced apprehensions regarding the potential physical safety hazards linked with allowing transgender athletes to join women's sports. The decision to reassess gender guidelines is deemed essential to uphold equity and safeguard the sanctity of women's sports. Involving medical professionals and experts in evolutionary biology in the review process is perceived as an acknowledgement of the scientific and physiological aspects at the heart of this discourse. This resolution addresses genuine apprehensions about upholding fairness in competition and ensuring the well-being of female athletes. It underscores broader democratic principles concerning the preservation of fundamental gender norms and the maintenance of women's sports as distinct entities.